everyone and welcome to day, um, I don't remember what day it is, I think like five, six, I don't know, six, day six, day six of our Jordan trip. We are on the way to the Dead Sea today and to a town called Madaba. So yesterday we just explored Petra a little bit more and we, we were walking for like seven hours straight with no food and then we went and got a Turkish bath and that was awesome, well an Arabic bath and it was really nice. We went into like a steam room and then they gave us a massage and a scrub and everything so it was really lovely. And I'm pretty tired today and I didn't film breakfast or anything. We had a two hour drive and we're going to the Dead Sea today too, yay! Just a quick stop in the spring of Moses. Um, apparently when he st struck his... Oh, I can't think of words today, what's it called? His staff water appeared. I think so. So Moses, instead of speaking to a rock, he struck the rock with his step. So he do believe in the power of his step more than the power of God. So actually, according to the very uh, diary of the Old Testament, that's why Moses being punished and died before he entered into the Holy Land area. Step down. Below sea level. to the Dead Sea and we're just walking down the stairs to the shore that was the resort before that you might have seen which is like you know a pool and just for all the tourists oh my gosh and people are actually floating in there this is so cool I can't believe we're here look this is awesome my boat we're here and it looks cold but it's actually quite nice it's spitting a bit but it's all right my gosh there's people floating Wow, I'm so excited. Everyone's floating out there. It's so fun. It's seriously so much fun. It, you, you float. Oh, zoomed in. It's so much fun. You like float so easily. You don't have to put your head under. You're just floating, and it's actually really hard to stand back up. And yeah, we just came out because we're gonna put mud on ourselves now. Get all young and stuff. Because <laughs> apparently minerals are so good for you and makes you 10 years younger. Just finished, and we put heaps of mud all over ourselves from the Dead Sea. I'll put a photo here because I couldn't really film it. But um, yeah, it was so much fun. And you just literally just float. It's so cool. And Bo, what do you have on your head? What have you got on your forehead? I don't know, someone wrote it on me. I don't know. I love MK. <laughs> I had to take the, that opportunity. Bye bye, we didn't get long, we only got like an hour, which isn't 
that great. That's what sucks with tour groups, is that you have to leave when they say you can't just stay for as long as you want. But uh, nonetheless, it was awesome. So, yeah, so we went from being at the one of the highest points, you know, Everest Base Camp, to one of the lowest points, which reminds me, I need to take stone. I need to take stone, I forgot. Dead Sea Swim and now we are at Mount Nebo. This is where Moses was buried and yeah this is his memorial. So That's amazing. Wow. Look at the view from up here and the church that's getting rebuilt. Did hate you today? Yeah. Because it was raining down there. And the sun shining, so it makes so we're it. We're back from the Dead Sea, Mount Nebo, and a little bit of shopping, and we've just been chilling in our hotel room here in Madaba. We are going out for dinner now. We're going to have a traditional Arabic food. I think we might just get like some hummus and some bread. We're not really that hungry, but yeah, we'll just see what's there. And there's apparently, like a party because it's end of the week. So Thursday is the end of the week, and Friday's their holiday. So. Appetizers it's for two salad, and they're bringing hummus. Awesome. And here's our main. We got penne with tomato. food but yeah today was epic I mean the Dead Sea was just something else I wish we could have stayed there for longer but doesn't matter but anyways I'm really tired I'm gonna have a shower and then go to bed I'm not gonna vlog for the rest of Jordan I don't think I'm just going to end it here but I hope you guys have enjoyed Jordan as much as I have because seriously this is such an incredible country and I want everyone to understand that it's not dangerous at all like we just walked home in the dark it's it's so safe people are actually friendly there's nothing going on here this is a very safe and secure country so definitely get over here and see it. i really hope you guys have enjoyed this and seeing jordan anyways thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next video